Hello and welcome to Hosted FTP Tutorials. This last tutorial is going to cover three advanced tips and tricks you can use to accomplish your FTP needs. Today, we're going to cover the quick look tool, the transfer queue and how to use it, and the synchronizing feature. Let's get started. CyberDuck allows you to take a peek at a file on your server directly from your local network. Go to the View tab and select Customize Toolbar. When the Tools icon opens, look for the Quick Look icon. Click and drag this icon to your toolbar and to use it, simply highlight the file you want to take a look at and press the Quick Look icon you just added to your toolbar. To ensure you're able to view the file, make sure you have the correct corresponding program on your computer. When you click Quick View, this will download a temporary copy to your device and once complete, the file will automatically open. Using the Quick Look icon allows you to take a look at the files on your server quickly and efficiently. One of CyberDuck's awesome features is the ability to change the preferences and settings on your transfers. If you go to the CyberDuck tab and click Preferences, you can visit the Transfer tab to change or view the default download directory. Additionally, you can actually lower the speed of your transfers so it doesn't consume your bandwidth affecting your internet. In the transfer queue, find the speed icon and using the drop down menu, you can change the maximum speed of your transfers. Alternatively, you can even reduce or increase the amount of concurrent transfers that can happen simultaneously. Using the arrows beside the speed icon, you can change the amount of simultaneous uploads or downloads. If you don't have the transfer queue shortcut enabled on your toolbar, you can go to the view tab, customize toolbar, and click and drag the transfers icon to your toolbar to enable the shortcut. Lastly, the synchronizing feature allows you to mirror a folder from your server onto your device or from your device onto your server. This will transfer any files that are different or not included in the folder you want to mirror. To synchronize a folder, right click, press the action icon, or go to file and select synchronize. Browse your local directory for the folder you want to mirror or mirror to and select OK. The transfer queue will open and after a delay, the synchronizing window will open. Using the drop down menu, you can choose mirror to make your local folder or remote folder match, upload to have your remote directory sync to your local directory, or download to have your local directory sync to your remote directory. If this video was helpful, give us a like to let us know what kind of content we should continue to make and let us know what FTP client you want us to cover next. Check out www.hostedftp.com for all your FTP needs or email us at support at hostedftp.com for your business inquiries. Thank you so much for watching and on behalf of everyone here at Hosted FTP, we want to thank you for choosing us as your service provider.